So guys, the 777 celebration is currently here. Uh, login bonuses have just started. We don't have everything available right now, but at least the daily login bonuses are currently here. Uh, first one we're going to get is upon initial login, you get 13 dragon stones, and then you get 777 small, 77 medium, and 7 large physical orbs. Um, you get 13 dragon stones, like I said, plus the 7 on the initial login for today. So overall, that's going to be 20 stones you get, plus the 2 stones that you're getting for the 200 million uh, login bonuses. Uh, plus whatever login bonus you're getting the basic one and you still have the 200 million uh, login bonus or 200 million download celebration reward so that's another 20 right there so that should be a total of 42 today once you complete the missions overall really freaking awesome i'm really super st uh, stoked about that let's go ahead and we're going to talk about the actual event that's going on first off we already went on the login bonuses um the 777 day celebration special missions are now available um right now they're currently not available because i'm recording this um at 2200 or 2230 uh, eastern time it says it's supposed to start pst so it's probably going to start in the middle of the night probably around 1 32 o'clock in the morning um lr hercule is currently available which is awesome uh you can't get them like right away but um, the reasoning because you need to get all of these belts and Hercule requires a whole bunch of belts in order to Doken Waken him. Now I'm not going to go fully in depth in this video. I'm just going to say that you need to get these belts. These belts are purchasable from the Baba shop under the Zenny section for 1 million Zenny a piece. You could purchase up to three a day for 1 million Zenny a piece. Um, you need to get them to Doken Waken the SR variant, the one that you see over here, which I'll show you right here. This guy, Earth Savior Hercule. Um, this guy is getting his Doken Awakening, and that that's the guy who is available from the Friend Summons. Uh, he's just, you know, SR from the Friend Summons. That's all there is to it. Uh, so that's cool. He gets his Doken Awakening to the, uh, oh yeah, look at me, I'm Hercule, to the Peace Sign Hercule. Uh, it's more of these uh, badges or medals to get him Doken Awakening, and then again, more uh, medals in order to get him Doken Awakening to his LR variant form. The LR variant form, not amazing, not amazing overall. Um, he's not someone, let me play this, he's not someone that you guys are really going to use. I'm not going to use him, you're not going to use him, unless you really don't have any other better characters and you have a whole bunch of Zenny, which I don't think is going to be the case. But if that is the case, then hey, you know, maybe you will want to go for him. Uh, more of a defensive type of a card. Um, it's cool though, you know what I mean? I, I like the card, I like who, what, what they did with the LR Hercule. It's, it is kind of a little bit nostalgic right there when Hercule got uh, Majin Buu to become good. Well, that's, so that's cool. I mean, I'm probably going to go just to get him to Super Attack 10. I'm not going to do anything more with him because I think when, when you need to get him to, if you try to get him to Super Attack 20 with all dupe pads unlocked, it's going to cost you about 250 million Zenny. And I am not putting all that Zenny in just to have a freaking uh, SA20 Hercule with dupe pads unlocked. I'm not going to even put orbs into the guy. But anyway, I'm not trying to you know go too crazy on it but you know so that's cool he is here he is available um you get the hercules uh, world the, you know the platinum trophies are still there once a day so that's awesome get some zenny through that probabilities of big success great success and super success in training doubled uh doesn't mean guaranteed like it was for the two-year anniversary unfortunately i really feel like they should be at least the uh, big success guaranteed like they do i think that should just be a thing but it's not anyway it doesn't matter so whenever you do your training you you get a increased rate of maybe getting them that's cool next one is that we're going to talk about is the 16th world tournament let's just close out of you uh, we have the non-stop impact mr boo this is who i believe the card's going to be uh, this did come right after on the jp side as well right after the two-year celebration um and after the uh, vegeto so overall i'm not a really big fan of this i don't really like i kind of want to go for it just because i want to get him he is semi-farmable he's a mr boo so the intelligence ones the ones that i keep on babaing are finally going to have a, a use if i do end up getting him so if you get more than one of him guys make sure you just feed it into the two paths uh bottom right would probably be my first guess or my first suggestion just because the srs at some point you're going to get him at super attack 10 um, i don't really find him that viable though i mean yes he is an orb changer intelligence to rainbow and he recovers 5000 hp but that flat out boost of hp recovery is really not good in my opinion um but you know the fact that he is an orb changer makes him so somewhat viable depending on the type of team you're trying to run um he is a good unit, so he is going to be running on a super team, which is the Super Saiyan 3 Angel Goku, or if you're going to have the uh, merge Zama, like the, Ma not the merge Zamasu, the Zamasu, the d double Zamasu, uh, Rose and Zamasu LR card, um, that, that, those are the only two he's really going to run on, and even at that point, I mean, I guess it, may, it would make it easier, because I prefer, uh, me personally, I prefer type to rainbow, because it makes it more likely that you're going to get off super attacks but even so um, i don't find him a very useful card he only lowers attack if they gave him greatly lowers attack then i would say he's a really good unit <clears throat> but link skills are 
pretty, to, you know, for uh, again for a hero team, really not that great. Uh, he more has the link skill set for a villains team or villain characters, so he would do good on an LR Zamasu and Rose team. But uh, outside of that, not so much. Uh, but he is going to be coming available, guys. So you know, go for it if you guys want to go for it. I'm not going to go too hard. I just kind of want to come in first place in the world tournament, just to you know get myself set with all the medals since my LR hurt, my LR Piccolo is already maxed out. Um, I just want to get the other ones for the other Dokken Way Kings. Now this, this one I'm super hyped about. You guys will, de this is, a, if you've been following me, I know I've been saying I'm not going to summon a lot on this, I'm not going to summon a lot on that, uh, but I'm going to summon a lot on this one. As, you know, not a lot, a lot, but enough. Uh, I really want Korra. I really want Korra. First of all, I really hope they throw the physical Omega Shenron on his banner just because I wasn't able to pull him. If you guys have been watching, you know, um, I haven't been able to pull him, but Korra's coming, guys. I can't wait. I am super stoked. First off, I do want to say um, Korra is coming. This is the SSR variant from him. He is the Extreme 120 lead. Now, the reason why um, the Extreme Physical 120 lead. Now, the reason why I really want that for the uh, 120 lead is just because the Extreme Physical units are so versatile. You could do so much with them. There are so many different uh, options that you can use when running a Physical Extreme team. I just think they are an amazing team overall by the way um i'm definitely gonna be looking for physical core friends assuming i pull him if i can get lucky enough to pull him i will be looking for physical core friends so i'll let you know if i do pull him if i don't pull him then i'm not gonna be you know looking for anyone but i'm definitely gonna look for him because not a lot of people went for him on jp i'm really hoping it's not the same case on the global side but anyway um just wanted to let you guys know i will be doing this in depth again in the future the same thing with the lr hercule and in their own separate videos cora obviously has his own medals it's gonna be 77 of those the Technique Korra gets a Doken Awakening, the Agility Korra from Baba Shop gets a Doken Awakening, and Thouser gets a Doken Awakening. Now, my personal recommendation, obviously Physical Korra if you pull him, but Thouser is really actually a decent unit. Um, he's, I believe he's like 35 medals, 21 medals. So he, he Dokens with 21 medals right now, only obviously only available on the JP side. But the reasoning be, is because when Super 17 comes out, He's not a bad unit. Um, he's not going to be your best support unit, but he will run decently for a while on an extreme agility team, uh, just because he gives agility type agility types key plus two and attack and defense plus twenty percent. So he's making them hit a little bit harder. Um, overall, decent unit. And um, if you guys saw it before, they there are two. There's another agility core over here, and you know those two will link pretty decently as well. I'm not saying it's going to be ideal for you, but they will link with each other. But anyway, guys, 777 Celebration has started. Make sure you log in. Make sure you get those rewards. Uh, make sure you're still grinding out those missions. I just wanted to go over the, the information with you. Stay tuned. Hit that sub button if you're new here, and I'll catch you guys later.